If you ordered a Jobber headset or plan on ordering a Jobber wireless headset to connect to your Cisco phone, and you want the ability to answer and end calls away from the phone, we're gonna show you how to do that in this video. So let's get into that right now. Out of the box, with any Jobber wireless headset that connects to a desk phone, there's an included phone cord so you can use the headset, but it won't allow you to actually answer and end calls when away from the phone. The cord looks just like this. It's a flat cord with a small clip on each end. This is where the Jobber Link 43 cable comes in handy because it will allow you to answer and end calls away from the phone. The first thing that you wanna do is take the standard phone cord that came included, and we're gonna connect it into the back of your Jobber charging base. There's an icon that shows a phone and keypad. Go ahead and plug it in there. Take the other end of that cord, and we're gonna connect it in the back of the Cisco phone. There's gonna be a spot that will show a picture of a pair of headphones. So flip the desk phone upside down, go over to the headset port, and we're gonna plug it in. Once that's plugged in, go ahead and take the Link 43 cable. And as you can see, there's gonna be two different sizes of clips. You wanna make sure to take the one with the red symbol and plug it into the back of your Jobber charging base. There's only one spot that it can plug in. Once you connect it there, you're gonna take the other end and we're gonna plug it into the aux port of the phone. So there's a number of different spots you can possibly plug this cable into. Make sure it goes into the aux port. So that's plugged in and it's fully connected. At this point, on the Jobber charging base, there's a compatibility switch. So if you can see here, there's a switch labeled A through G. You wanna move this over so it says, uh, so it's on setting B as in Bravo. Switch that over and you're set up and ready to go. Also, keep in mind, there's a setting within your Cisco phone that may need to be adjusted. Usually you can do it on the Cisco phone itself, but if you can't, you may need to get your phone system admin involved and there's a setting called hook switch mode. That needs to be enabled. If that's disabled, you will not get the ability to answer and end calls when away from the phone. After the setup of the headset with the Link 43 cable and making sure that your Cisco phone has the hook switch mode enabled, if you're still not getting remote call answering, there's another trick that you can try. So go ahead and go to the Link 43 cable. There's a small cover you see here, peel this back. It's a micro USB port. Take a micro USB cable, plug it in, plug the other end into your computer, and from there, download Jobber Direct and run through a firmware update to see if that's the fix. If you haven't already ordered the Link 43 cable or if you need to order more, go ahead and visit the link in the description of this video and use coupon code YouTube for an additional discount. Also, if you ever need to verify compatibility or if you want help with a headset recommendation in the future, Contact us today and one of our advisors will be more than happy to help. And if you haven't done so already, to help support our channel, consider hitting the like, subscribe, and notification bell for more videos just like this. For those of you who are considering switching away from desk phones and going to a computer-based phone system, there's gonna be another video right up here. Check it out and it will bring you to a popular Jabra wireless headset that connects with your computer applications. That's it for now. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.